Hello, hello YouTube viewers, this is Blake Finn. Listen, I don't care what you've done or how much you've sinned, but Jesus died to forgive you and I both. Listen, <clears throat> whatever you've done, Jesus died to forgive you in me both. Listen, I, w I was up at 2 a.m. on the morning I made this. I was up from 2 until about 4 or 5 a.m. on the morning I made this. Well, I w went back to bed between 4 and 5. I did didn't pay attention to what time. It but I did didn't pay attention to what time I went to bed. Well, I woke back up. I woke back up around seven a.m. Well, my granny came in my room, was hanging up clothes after she she'd done some laundry. Well, we we were talking, and then she then she left the room. Then she came back in, and then I felt around my uh, private area, and then I realized I had peed just a little bit in my underwear. And when then when I got up to change, I was saying like something like this: "Ew, I peed in my pants. That's so nasty. Ew." Well, I was running and changing as fast as I possibly could. And then the whole time I was changing and going on about how nasty I felt, Granny was Granny was making fun of me saying, Blake peed in his pants. Blake peed in his pants. La, 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 la. Blake peed in his pants. Like, like that. Well, that made me so... <laughs> that made me so mad. That I told her to shut up. Uh, I mean, I know it's not funny. I know it's not funny, but I can't help laughing. It's. I, well, let me rephrase that. I know it shouldn't be funny, but it is funny. And anyway, she kept saying, Blake peed in his pants. La 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 la. And I'm, I was so mad at her. I said, shut up. And I, I didn't call her a very bad name, but I called her something you should never call someone. It wasn't a cuss word, but it was a bad word. I said, shut up, you blank. Well, after I got finished changing under shorts and washing my hands, I w went back to b bed. Then I got back up around 9.30 a.m. And I felt guilty over it. Well, I felt so guilty that I was like, I, sh I don't need to apologize. She wouldn't forgive me anyway. After what I called her. Well, I went ahead and got up the nerve and the courage and I said, Granny, I'm sorry I called you that. And then she didn't say nothing and then I just said, I just re repeated myself. I said, Granny, I'm sorry I called you that. And she said, I heard you, Blake, I heard you. So, YouTube viewers... The main reason I'm telling you this is whenever you're mad or aggravated at somebody, it's best to keep your pie hole shut. Thank you. Please like, share, and s subscribe.